So this is the skate park that we found here in Vancouver, uh, Victoria on Vancouver Island. And I've been skating here with my hat on. As you can see, I've been getting actually a couple compliments about my skate hat here in BC. A lot of people ask me what it's called, and it's called a TAM. And I think it's pretty good for holding my dreads back when I'm skating. So this was an amazing first time trial here at the skate park, indoor ramps. And uh, there's some clips to come. This is, this is just a dread update showing you how I skate with my dreads sometimes covered. So you're not actually going to see my dreads in this dreadlock update but i have been growing on for about five years and the fact is freeform dreads can get pretty thick and when you're skating with them i don't understand how guys like nigel houston used to skate with them all the way down to the floor it's crazy but let me know in the comments below how long you had your dreads for and how do you skate with them if you are a skater biker snowboarder skier whatever an athlete I'll see you guys in the next update. So enjoy the clips. Peace out. One love. We'll see you guys around. Peace. Okay. Hey man. Yeah, I'm gonna try it out.
a shoelace for this. So get one. Oh. I, as you were saying that, I saw that on the ground. I was like, oh, that's good though, eh? Okay, I know what we can take. The thing to my purse. Grab the thing from my purse. It unclips. Oh. It unclips, baby. He's so hard-headed, or, or he is getting it, I don't know. This is such a different experience with, with these wheels. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Hey. All right, let's do it. <laughs> Clearly I'm not the one doing it. <laughs> Color should we go with? It's too black. Orange would be. Okay, we need to tie up the pants here so it stops being a problem. <laughs>
Wow. Shout out to Steve. Awesome skate shop owner. Yeah, they're pretty sick, eh? Let's see them. Woo! Influence board shop and indoor ramp. Great influence on the community there. Bam, bam.